Namaste guys in this video we are going to learn what is broaching so broaching is a machining process in which a multi point tool called broach whose teeth can remove desired material from the job in a single stroke now let's see what are the different components of a broach so the first component or part is front pilot the purpose of front pilot is to make sure that when you fit your broach tool in your part or job it correctly align with respect to it okay the second one is roughing teeth the purpose of roughing teeth is to make sure that it removes the material roughly from the surface the roughing teeth has high feed of cut and after that is semi finishing teeth semi finishing teeth also has teeth but its feed is low and the last one is finishing teeth the finishing teeth has the lowest feed of cut remember lower the feed of cut higher is the surface finishing you will get that is the reason they are named as per the feed and here you will see the pull end pull end basically is the place where you apply your force and pull it remember a broaching tool is always used in pull direction it is never used in pull push direction okay you never push from the back side if you do you will face pro problem i will tell you later onwards why the next one is root diameter it is the diameter of the front pilot okay and the last one is overall length that that is the total length of our broach tool now a question arises in your mind that how does this broach tool work as you can see in the animation when broach tool go inside here you can see it removes firmly all the material from the surface this is how a broach tool works here the teeth you are seeing is currently are roughing surface teeth that has a high feed of cut that is the reason it removes the material easily remember the video you are showing is currently more high feed of cut in reality the purpose of showing is that so that you can visualize if i show a real feed of cut or a real broach tool working you will not able to see difference uh, very easily it will take time so just it just a animation so that you can visualize how it is working now a question arises why we only pull the broaching tool why don't we push suppose you push the broaching tool the problem with the pushing is that you will buckle your broach tool and it will break that is the reason we never use pushing force in broaching tool we always use pulling suppose you start pulling the worst thing happen with your broaching tool that it will just stretch nothing else so i hope you learned something from this video if you have any kinds of doubts and queries make sure that you ask in comments you can also check out the blog link in description for better understanding what is broaching i hope you learned something from this video if you have any kinds of doubts and queries make sure that you ask in comments Thanks for watching and have a great day